mama's just peeking at the camera here. It is a very, very exciting day today because it is a Friday, first of all. I love Fridays. And I know there's like everyone loves Fridays because for a lot of us, it's the end of our work week for a few days. People can get paid on Friday. There is a million reasons to love Friday. Why I love Friday is because one, Spotify's release radar is shared every single Friday. New music released from my favorite artists every single Friday makes me very excited to get up in the morning. And two, also on the theme of music, I'm going to Dermont Kennedy today. <laughs> been to a concert okay well okay so I went to go see Mariana's Trench bye mama I went to go see Mariana's Trench in concert a few months ago I don't even know when that was good and it was really cool because we it wasn't like in a, a big arena it was in a performance part of a casino and me and my friend were in the back of the casino watching the lead singer of mariana's trench got off the stage and was walking around the whole floor and he was right behind us when we were listening to him perform like he was i have i will pull up a picture right here there's a picture that i have where he was right behind me singing still performing his songs right there that was so cool so cool especially because i grew up like i'm pretty sure the first song i knew by heart was a Mariana Trench song, and I'd never seen it perform, so that was really cool. I'm going to some concerts back to back for the next few months, and I'm so excited. I don't think I've been to a big concert since Billie Eilish. That can't be right. That was like two years ago. I saw Billie Eilish. Oh my god. Because Dermot Kennedy's performing at Rogers Arena. I'm trying to think the last time I was at Rogers Arena. And I don't think it was before I went to Billie Eilish when I was in Vancouver. Anyway, that's a lot of math that you don't care about and <laughs> neither do I, honestly. So yeah, I haven't been to a concert in a few years, like a real big stadium concert. And I'm so excited. The only thing I will note is that at Billie Eilish, I bawled my freaking eyes out and I had no idea I was going to. But I mean, like, honestly, how can you not cry at Billie Eilish? She's a queen, she's a god. I love her so much, but Dermot and Kennedy, Hey friends, Future Krista here. Um, I just want to note that I say Dermont Kennedy throughout this whole video, but Jaws corrected me last night to let me know that it is Dermot Kennedy. No N. Dermot Kennedy. So if it bugs you that I'm not saying his name right the whole video, don't worry, because it bugs me too. Happy watching! The best way that I can describe his music for how it affects me personally is it is like sad girl songs, but they're not all sad. Like there's so much passion and pain and emo emotion. That's the best way to say it. Cause they're not all sad. I want to know. Dermot Kennedy, like he doesn't write these really sad songs. He writes really emotional songs. Like you hear any song by him and you can attach something that it connects with for you personally in your life to his songs. And I have been blasting his music all morning just to like get more familiar. Cause like, you know, you go to a concert, you want to know the most songs that you can. I thought I only knew like one of the songs. I was playing his album. I know like at least half the songs, which makes me feel very good about going to his concert and actually being able to sing along to the words. But yeah, I'm going with two amazing friends that I have and we got these tickets. Oh my God, it had to be at least six to eight months ago. And it's so exciting to go to a concert. It's like girl math. My concert's free. I have to pay to get there and back. But besides that, concert's free. Concert is free for me. It's makeup time. As you can see, we have a gorgeous face all done, all ready for tonight. Just kidding. Well, that's a little bit better. Makeup is done. Get into this golden glow here we've got going on. Oh my God, it is such a gorgeous day. Like I can't believe that it's almost Halloween and I can go out in this. Let me show you. This is the fit of the night. I guess I'll show that off as well got leather pants cute little top here and the jean jackets just for show of course i feel so good oh i need to wear makeup more often even though i don't like it's a whole thing i'm not someone who wears makeup normally my skin doesn't like it i don't like it i work at home so i don't need to wear makeup every day but man like i feel so good when i wear makeup but I also feel amazing when I don't wear makeup and that's the most important thing. But yeah, I got ready on my lunch break. So I have to run a few errands before that ends and then I can go back to work for a few hours and then I gotta run to Jocelyn's house and get ready for Dermot Kennedy. I am so excited and it's gonna be a great night. So stay tuned for more fun concert shenanigans. Okay, we are just about to head out to head to Jocelyn's house to get ready for the concert. I just love concerts because you get more dressed up than you would if you were just going out for a night and you just get like a little bit less dressed up than you would if you're going out for Halloween. 
At least that's how I get dressed up. Maybe I'm the crazy one here. For example, I remember that I bought some really cool stencils at the Halloween store and I just came across them getting ready. And you know that we gotta add some hearts to this. I tested them out down here, very, very cute. And I also have a few other stencil designs, so I'm bringing them to Jocelyn's house. So if the girls wanna try them on, they can most definitely do that too. And then I also found my Valentine's Day necklace. It's just missing one little heart here, but it really goes with the vibe. And I also found this little ring here. It's my little lips. I'm sweating, I'm sweating, I'm sweating, I'm sweating. I have been standing in front of this fan periodically all day after I did my makeup because I sweat, especially on my face, and the moment I do, the makeup goes, and I don't know how much you know about makeup, but if you lose makeup in a tiny spot, and you try to put makeup over on that tiny spot, it ruins your whole face of makeup, so by not letting that happen, we're gonna use a fan all day, every day. Ah. Uh, anyway. The reason I'm even doing a pink vibe today is because yesterday when I was trying on outfits for what I wanted to wear to the concert today, I tried on this shirt, and I was like, okay, cute, cute, cute. We love a good pink moment. And then getting ready today, I did a pink lip and thought the pink lip stood out a bit. So I put on a little bit of pink eyeshadow. And then, like I just said, while getting ready, I found a little pink stencil. Oh, and I also tested them out of my head. <laughs> I forgot about that. Then when the red came out, we popped on the red ring. And I'm even wearing my Barbie pink heels tonight. It's gonna be so good, I'm so excited. Like, I don't know what came over me, but I am just really in need of a girl's night. I'm really in need of a night out. I'm really in need of a night that's just surrounded by a bunch of people, scream singing the same songs, crying to songs that we all feel pain from, that we all feel love from, that we all feel emotion from. I am so ready for tonight. It is going to be an absolutely amazing night. So let's head over to Jocelyn's house and let the party continue there. So. Yeah. We're headed to the concert. Smile for the vlog. <laughs> okay, let's go. fade you know some memories that are so special that you can still right now as I'm talking to you conjure up every detail you know think of everything we were with exactly what it looked like then and certain memories can I think be almost like a safety net sometimes when you need them and can be somewhere you can hide and so what I want you to do is just let that light represent whatever memory is slowly coming into your head as I'm talking like this just let it some day or some time that to you is just too special to fade. Just keep that. Ignore whoever you're with. Just close your eyes. Whatever works. Whatever you need to get back to that time as clearly as you can, okay? But keep that light there.
just finished the concert. It was so good. We had such a good time. We sang so hard the whole time. And now it's time to go home and have a good night. Okay, I am back at home now. It is about two in the morning and it was a great day, great night, great evening. You can tell by my throat that I've been singing and screaming and yelling and cheering all night. And the most beautiful part about it is that I just took an Uber home and Jawson texted me while I was in the Uber saying, look outside, there's Northern Lights. I have not actually, for my own eyes, seen Northern Lights in years. So I was looking out my window the whole time as if I was sightseeing somewhere, just in awe about the Northern Lights. And when I got home, I went outside to see if I could see any from my backyard. I'm gonna insert the video here because I literally watched Northern Lights dance around the sky. Today has just been a magical day. And I hope that you were able to find magic in your day somewhere. Stay amazing, stay true, stay you. Till next time.